Good day to everyone. This is the second lesson in the course Analysis in Lira Supper, and in this lesson I will introduce to you different types of finite elements. Let's create our new problem. Choose fifth model type, 6 degrees of freedom, and write name of problem finite elements. First of all, let's talk about theory. Any constructive model consists of nodes, bars, plates and volume bodies, which are called finite elements. We know or we can analyze displacement of each node of element in this model. After approximation of this displacement, we got behavior of the model under the law, namely deformation and efforts in elements. For modeling different finite elements, we need to create a lot of nodes. First method of, crea of node creation we learned in previous lesson. Let's consider another method. First of all, we need to create rectangular grid. Click on the button Create Cartesian Grid. In this window, uncheck Specify with Pointer. Our grid will start from coordinate 0, 0, 0. Select plane X, O, Y. And in table, set steps of our grid. Step along first axis will be 10 times per 1 meter. And along second axis, the same, 10 times per 1 meter. Click Apply. You can see a grid with points, but these points are not nodes yet. To set nodes on intersection of axis, click on the button Add Node on Grid. Now you can set nodes one by one or by selecting with frame. Now each intersection of axis is green, which means that nodes are set. Let's create different finite elements. We learned how to create bars in previous lesson. We just select nodes one by one. We use bars to model beams, frames, trusses and columns. Next finite element is 3 node plate. To create 3 node plate, we need to select 3 nodes one by one. Also, there is 4 nodes plate. Creation is similar to previous type of finite element, but now we need to select 4 nodes one by one. These finite elements are used in modeling floor and foundation slabs, casting situ walls and diaphragm of rigidity. Next type of finite element is one node element. In the window you can see different numbers of these finite elements. Information about every finite element you can find in Lira Supper Help. Find the button question mark on the right top of the window and click on it. Select line help and click on it. Select from the li list line comments and click on it twice. Click on the first line FE library and here you can find information about every type of finite element. In our task let's create element number 56. This element is used for setting piles. Select Nodes and click Apply. We will skip next methods of setting elements because they represent creation elements, which we just learned. And let's tap on the volume element. To create volume element, first of all, let's copy following nodes on 1 meter along axis Z. In Edit Group, find button Copy by Parameters and in line DZ, write 1 and click Apply. Now in this space, we can create Volume Finite element. Select nodes from created space one by one. And click Apply. You can create cubes and prisms. Cubes contains 8 nodes, 
Prisms contains six nodes. These types of finite elements are used for modeling soil massive. Every type of finite element has its own number. You can see the number of elements with the help of command information. Don't forget to save your problem and see you on the next lesson.